just arrived in Zurich. It's a beautiful sunny day. I'm about to head to Hito, which is the oldest vegetarian restaurant according to the Guinness Book of World Records. So, let's give it a try. We're the oldest vegetarian restaurant in the world. Yeah. Um, and yeah, we just like to be like very open to all our guests. And that's why we have this huge window in here um, where you can see uh, into the kitchen where the magic happens. Yeah. It wasn't very popular to eat vegetarian or vegan food back then. The grand grandfather of uh, Rolf Hilton, the, the, the owner now, um, he was sick um, and his doctor said uh, he told him to, to eat vegetarian. So he came here and then he liked the place so much and then he bought it. And Here is the part where they prepare all the hot dishes for the buffet. One of the most popular dishes uh, might be the Hiltel Tartar. It's like a vegetarian version of the beefsteak Tartar. What is your favorite dish to eat? Very, very difficult. Um, I really like the burger. Um, what is it made out of? Um, it's made out of, um, of soy. Well, I mean, we we use a lot of, of soy, um, all, all, all things like lentils. Um, I mean, there's so much plant-based food which contains protein. We have a little store, like the Hiltel shop, where we sell um, a couple of homemade products and, and other stuff. We sell our own wines, okay. um, yeah, chutney sauces. Lemonades, curries, everything you need. You can, these are uh, syrups to, to make lemonades at home. So we just mix it with soda or, or tap water, and you have a super fresh lemonade. Well, we have like a, a department which is always creating new recipes and dishes. The Hilton Buffet mm -hmm. yeah. um, has around 100 vegetarian and vegan dishes um, and there are several seasonal changes on it. Um, vegan love story is, yeah. um, is from Hilton and Tibbets. So we did that together. This one we have uh, in English and German. And the English one is for you. Oh my god, for me? Yeah, sure. Oh my god. And yeah, then you can try some of our vegan recipes. take inspiration from all over the world. Um, in the even early 50s, the grandmother of Rolf Hilton uh, went to India and she came back with a suitcase full of spices and then she started uh, cooking Indian food here. Nobody liked it, but she kept on cooking. We have employees from over 60 nations. So they all bring like recipes and nice dishes from, from their own countries and we, we always try to like include them in our menu or on the buffet. During summer we, we host a barbecue courses up here, courses for professional chefs. Um, so they come 
and learn more about vegetarian and vegan uh, kitchen. It's called Zürich Schnatzwitz. This is uh, normally made with um, sliced veal and then on a creamy um, mushroom sauce. Uh, and it's served with hash brown. And we have a vegetarian version here, which is very delicious. After getting food at the buffet, everything was so good. I got just a variety of everything. I got vegan chicken nuggets, vegetables, curries, pastas, anything you can imagine. I wanted to try it all. The food was really good. The flavor was there. All the seasoning. Delicious. I feel like I got some really interesting things, eggs, rice, all different types of protein, guacamole. And then to finish it off, I got a lemonade drink which was fizzy. It was so refreshing. The whole restaurant turns into a club from Friday till Sunday. Yeah, and then it's just like we just remove all the tables and, and, and chairs and, and then music turns up, DJ's coming. I just finished eating at Hitel. The food was so good. The hospitality was even better and they gave me this cookbook. So I'm going to be making some DIY videos with it. I just want to say a big thank you to Milo and all the people at Hitel. This was amazing. I had the best time there. Everyone was so nice and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. See you next time. Oh,